Hey VV Nation, welcome to the channel. My name is Glenn, Senior Stock Market Strategist for VectorVest. Glad to be doing the last 6 p.m. video for the year of 2024, going into 2025. And yes, it's going to be a quantum video. Seems like the hottest video that we did this year was recently with the quantum stocks. It set the stage, we've done a lot more videos, and it's been accepted by you in a big way. But the problem is, how do you know if the space is still a good solid space? If I look at uh, the market today, a lot of these are getting killed. Why? Because there's a lot of profit taking. So. I think that the highs for the year for quantum are gonna be really big highs, but I also think that the lows for the year for quantum will be really low lows. So I wanna set the table from letting you know that this is going to be an aggressive space that could make you a lot of money, but you've gotta time the positions, when to get in and when to get out because you can take big losses in this space. Why? Because it's still all theoretical. The craze is going crazy right Right now because people want to jump on board and a lot of people have made a lot of money to include myself but knowing that it is a speculative space going into the new year you got to keep your eyes on the prize but make sure that you've got a plan in place to lock in profits and don't give it all back if you get nothing else from this video I love this space but I also need you to know how to trade it and all throughout the year we will give you updates on what to do and when to do it. But tonight will be what I call my Q10 or Quantum 10 stocks. And we're gonna rock and roll and we're gonna get right into it. So let's start off with the news. Why do I like the stocks that I like? Now, before we get started, there's three stocks that we're gonna have no news, are gonna be my top three stocks in the space. That's gonna be Nvidia, Google, and Amazon, all taking steps in the quantum space to shore up their involvement in this space. So no news, they're already big name stocks. You know, Google with Willow, Amazon's getting in, Nvidia's getting in. But I wanna look at a lot of the, the lower name stocks that not everybody knows about just quite yet, or are possibilities for you to get into for the year. First story is quantum computing stocks soar Wall Street analysts take a bullish stance. Now, as I read this article, it talked about a lot about the stocks that are making move. Um, much has happened in the Google's and the quantum space earlier this month. Google unveiled the quantum computing chip known as Willow, which is capable of handling complex calculations in the span of five minutes. Can handle calculations. Can it do it yet? Not quite. There's the theoretical side. So we're making advances, and I think the big moves that will happen in quantum will be on any named advances, like the Willow deal, like a, a lot of the advances in the space is going to move quantum. That's why I think it's gonna have a wild ride. When there's a calm and nobody's talking about it, those stocks are gonna be taking hits because a lot of people have made a lot of money. Wall Street sentiment, uh, sentiment also jumped into the debate about quantum computing, having a largely started with a bullish views, but with a hint of what? Caution. Again, if you get nothing else from this video, the caution part needs to take place. All right, next stock, Arquette. Uh, secures a shareholder approval for capital expansion. Anytime a company grows their money or makes money to put back into the company because of a space or because of an idea that they think can take off, I think that's always a positive thing. Qubit um, is creating some noise and making the most of the quantum computing industry surge in 2024. The field has seen breakthroughs. Again, that's going to be the big move of quantum computing going into 25. There was one stuff of science, but Qubit is right in the midst of it. From quantum chemistry advances, advancements to less inclined computer errors. 2024 has been a turning point for the newborn quantum industry. So it's really in its infancy and that's why the wave is going and everybody's going crazy over it, but it's still relatively new. Now I did a video about two years ago on quantum computing. From then until now, there's been a lot more advances with a lot more companies jumping on board. Another company that's in my list, Coherent. Price target raised to 120 from 100 at Morgan Stanley. Big, 
money managers are getting on board in the quantum space as well. That will always drive prices higher. But again, it's going to be the advancements that keep it sustainably higher rather than taking a hit like it's doing today. But again, the hit today is because a lot of people have made a lot of money. I'm gonna show you that in a second. Record-breaking quantum computer has more than 1,000 qubits. Now that's the way that they track the data is in qubits as outside of bits and it's you know from a um, computer standpoint these why it's theoretical because it's working at the atomic level that's science fiction now coming to reality Adam a stock that I'm currently still in has created the first quantum computer to, to surpass 1,000 qubits which can improve the accuracy of the machines that's huge. This is the kind of news that will drive the quantum space up throughout the year. Now that's on Adam. Next stock in my list is D-Wave. All right, D-Wave is a leader in the development of delivery of quantum computing systems, software, and services, and is the world's first commercial supplier of quantum computers and the only company building both annealing quantum computers and a gate model quantum computers. These are companies that are in my list today that are cutting edge technology in the, the infancy of the quantum space. This is why I love the stocks that I have in my Q10. It's sort of like the Mag 7, but we're gonna call it Q10 and I need you guys to make Q10 go viral throughout the world. I don't know how we do it, but we got to do it. All right, another one. Uh, IonQ, New York Stock Exchange showcases IonQ technology in the first ever recognition of a quantum company. Folks, that's on the New York Stock Exchange taking a look and IonQ is there. Whew. All right, Rigetti, a stock that I like a lot. Computing launches an 84 qubit Anchor 3 system. This came out on the 30th, which was yesterday. Rigetti Computing, a specialist in full stack quantum classical computing, announced the public launch of its 84 bit Anika, uh, Anka 3 system. It's Rigetti's new flagship quantum computer featuring an extensive hardware redesign that enables superior performance. It also celebrates a major two-bit gate fidelity milestone, uh, successfully having errors, error rates. That's also going to be huge, all right? So with um, those three, these seven make up my 10 stock portfolio called the Q10 for the whole quantum space. Now, I've got four honorable mentions. My four honorable mentions are going to be QNCFF, QNCCF. That's a low dollar stock in the space. And this is a collaboration. Crown Technologies and Quantum Emotion form an alliance to build the largest quantum secured blockchain. Holy smokes. Ding. Now we're locking in quantum with Bitcoin or with um, um, the whole idea of the blockchain. Hmm. That now takes both of these industries. Whew, I just turned this around. That takes both of these industries now to a net, to a whole nother level. Now, quantum, now you're looking at quantum computing along with crypto. Hmm. To build the largest quantum secured blockchain ecosystem. Wimmy. Wimmy explores smart contract driven cross chain communication technology to build an interconnected blockchain ecosystem. Holy smokes, again, now two companies in the quantum space that are now locking in to crypto. I think that quantum and crypto could have a huge year this year. We already know that crypto is heavily on the mind of the incoming president. Um, so I need to probably make a crypto portfolio. If you want to see me make a top 10 crypto portfolio for 2025, let me know. Just type the word crypto. That might have to be another portfolio that I've got to make. 
we're going to make a portfolio of these stocks and we're going to track them. Um, but if you're interested in a crypto from what we can do uh, with VectorVest, type the word crypto. I'd like to know, but I love the interconnectability between quantum and crypto, two industries that could explode going into the next year. Another stock that's on my list as an honorable mention is MicroCrowd, which is hollow. Um, hologram rockets with Quantum Leap. Again, type them in together. Rocketed Monday after the company developed an advanced technolo technological solution. Fast, a, a diabetic, a, a diabetic. Uh, Hollow's protocols surpassed the limitation of traditional method, methods like linear ramps, blah, 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 blah. So hollow is something that I'm keeping on my mind. And one last one, SEALS, L-A-E-S. A lot of people, Ryan called this. A lot of people have made a lot of money on it. I need you to understand why this is an honorable mention. Uh, regains NASDAQ compliance, strengthening the market positions. Prior to all of this, it was not doing well. Um, it went up, but look at this, down 16% today. Discover the latest stocks, blah, 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 blah. Seals has regained compliance with NASDAQ's minimum bid price requirement, securing its position on the stock market. This achievement reflects the company's closing bid price of a dollar for the last consecutive business days. LAES has made a lot of people a lot of money, but I need you to be careful, and that's why it is one of my honorable mentions. So, I got QNCCF. When uh, we meet hollow and LAES as my honorable mentions. All right, now let's get into the software and let's now take a look at the stocks in the software. I sorted it by our new indicator that I've now uh, analyzing stocks with the sort of RS times CI times growth. I think no matter what watch list you put together in the VectorVest system, you need to start using this. Stocks that have the high ability of meeting or exceeding earnings expectations because earnings drives a market higher or stock higher. CI, uh, the stock's ability to withstand long lengthy price declines and of course earnings growth. I love this combination of indicators that you can only find in VectorVest and guess what? If you wanna add this indicator to your watch lists, you gotta have a subscription to the software. We're still running a holiday special. Go to www.vectorvest.com forward slash YT. 99 cents gets you access to the VectorVest software for 30 days. You can start utilizing this indicator. Now you'll understand why NVIDIA, Amazon, and Google are on my top picks. Um, they're double digit positives with that indicator. But now I can go down towards the bottom and see which ones are in the negative. These are the ones I want to make and keep my eyes on. These are the more aggressive plays. Look at them. They're not fundamentally sound, but they are riding the coattails of the quantum space. These stocks are going to have great opportunities to go up. But as I can look at my list, I can clearly see which ones I know are going to be more aggressive plays and which ones are going to definitely be more of the higher quality, longer term plays. Let's now take a look at the honorable mentions. There's four of them. As I look at them, they've made a lot of money, but look at them, all of them are negative with that indicator. Hollow being the uh, least negative and LAS, LAES being the most negative. Also notice that these are not fundamentally sound stocks. I'm hoping that as we go into the year, we're going into a growth period in the stock market. Growth, these are gonna hopefully be um, growth stocks. We'll see, we'll see. But these are honorable mentions that I had to mention, but I wanted to, see, wanted to show you why they were honorable mentions and not on my main list. So I'm gonna go to portfolios real quick. Why is this spot so hot? 26%. Uh, since the 24th, look at that, a week, a week of my, uh, this was my original Q10 for 2025. It's changed. Three of the stocks are not here. Wimmy is not in my top 10. Um, AMAT's not in my top 10. And there's one more. QSI is not in my top 10 from this list. All right. Those have been replaced by three other stocks. But again, this was my first stab at my Q10 portfolio. Again, 26% in a week, 26% in a week. Now, a lot of these are getting hit. A lot of profits are being taken. But um, you look at the ROIs on some of these stocks, just in one week, 140% on QSI, on WIMI, 82, ARQQ, 39, Adam, 16. And even the ones that are going against us, these are manageable. 
That's why I had to create a portfolio. Now, I'm going to scroll down because this is now my new Q10 for 2025. Yes, I started a portfolio today. These are my top 10 stocks in a portfolio now for 2025, initiated on 1231. So we're going to run this portfolio, no stops. I want to see how this space with my top 10 picks for quantum rain out for the year. I'm gonna just let it go, whether good, bad, or indifferent. I am gonna tell you again, it's gonna be a rocky ride. It's definitely gonna be a rocky ride, but these 10 stocks are the ones that I want you to keep on your watch list for the year. And we'll get you in, Ryan and I, we will do updates to the quantum portfolio um, to give you ideas of when it's the right time to take profits or not. Folks, I'm excited. I'm excited about what this industry can do I'm excited about the advances that are going to come out possibly this year, but keep in mind, it is going to be a rocky ride. This is a phase. This is a craze. This is still, a lot of it is still theoretical, but I'm thinking that as we go throughout 2025, more advances will be made driving this portfolio higher. Folks, the last video for 2024, I want to thank each and every one of you for supporting VV Nation on our YouTube channel. If you're not a subscriber on our YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon so that you'll be alerted when videos like this come out. You don't wanna be behind the curve when it comes to quantum going into next year, all right? Um, I've given you the link to take advantage of the VectorVest software, 30 days, 99 cents, www.vectorvest.com forward slash YT. Thank you so much, folks. This video is over and I'm so excited. See ya. Hey, VV Nation, that time of the year is coming up again, where we kick off the year with our Tampa two-day event. It's going to be live uh, January 10th and 11th. And you know something? If you can't be there live, it's okay, because you can join the live stream for absolutely free. Go to www.vectorvest.com forward slash stream to register for the live event to stream it. I will be the host for your event, but we're going to have Steve Chappell, Jerry D. Ambrosio, Jim Penna. It's going to be an awesome event.